Hello there friends. I am currently headed to Trader Joe's. I have never been to a Trader Joe's, so we're gonna go check it out. I hear you get some free samples, and right now they have a lot of pumpkin stuff. I have heard another YouTuber, her name is Allison, I'll link her channel below. Um, she is a YouTuber and Instagrammer uh, here in Florida, does a lot of Disney content, highly recommend her. But she has been talking about some pumpkin ravioli in the last few of her videos, and I'm so intrigued. So we're gonna go to Trader Joe's, and see what we can find. All right, you guys, I'm in. It's a pretty small store, but the honey roast pumpkin ravioli is not here. I'm so sad. I like how the freezer section is open so you can look at everything and kind of like pick it up and check it out. I do know this is a marketing tactic, so I'm well aware of that, that you'd pick up stuff that you don't usually do in the freezer aisle, but I still think it's pretty cool. Lots of good options. Okay guys, we are back. That was fun. Um, yeah, it's a cool place. I've never been in there before. It was a lot smaller than I expected. Sadly, they weren't doing the samples because um, COVID, it ruins everything. But they should have the samples uh, back up and running soon. They did not, unfortunately, have the pumpkin ravioli. Um, he said he's pretty sure it is done for the season, which is kind of a bummer, but we found some good stuff. And we're having some friends over tonight, so I thought it'd be fun to do a little like cheese, charcuterie, char charcuterie board, charcuterie board. <laughs> I didn't say that right, but a cheese and meat board, so. Let's get into the haul. So I got some crackers to go with that. Um, they're just basic ones, flaky, flavorful ones. I didn't want to get anything with too much seasoning just because we want to focus on the cheese and the meat. I got the Everything Bagels. They have golden brown crust with soft chewy interiors, poppy seeds, onion, and minced garlic. They look delicious. I've heard a lot of good things about that. Then I got the Everything But The Bagel sesame seasoning sea salt garlic and onion people like rave about these and I do live about 45 minutes away from the store so I got two because I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like it I also got a autumnal harvest soup it's creamy tomato based soup with pumpkin and butternut squash that sounds delightful very excited to try that um, yeah, so I happened to be in the area today and thought it would be fun to check out this store and now if I end up liking it I'm gonna have to come back so that could be good or bad. <laughs> we got some veggie crisps. These are puffed potato snacks with spinach and tomato. They are vegan and gluten free. Then I got a lemon and I got the lemon specifically because I found holy meat cheese. Uh, when I studied in Greece, they had a halloumi cheese, and if you grill this, I know it sounds weird, but you put this on the stove, you get a little bit of lemon and a little bit of olive oil. It's the best cheese in the world. It's one of my favorite cheeses ever, so I'm going to let our friends try that. I got a pumpkin spice protein smoothie, just because I'm curious. It's 130 calories, so... Some mandarin orange chicken because I believe this is the one my mom was talking about. She's been to Trader Joe's before, got this, put it in the air fryer, and said it was delicious. Um, so yeah, they have a lot of really, really yummy frozen food selections. I got pumpkin spice rolls with pumpkin spice icing, but they're seasonal. We have to try them, we have to see how good they are. So I'm very excited about those. And then the cheeses. None of these are probably healthy options, but that's okay. Like I said, we're having friends over and we're gonna have some fun. So I've got the creamy Toscano, Toscano cheese dusted with cinnamon. That just sounded very interesting. Um, a natural turkey summer sausage, turkey raised on all vegetarian diet. Um, some Asiago, Asiago cheese with rosemary and olive oil. I like that they're shaped like cheesecakes. <laughs> um, I got everything but the bagel seasoned smoked salmon just because I love cold salmon. It's just it's so good. The thinly sliced one, yum. Um, I got a autumn product of Belgium washed rind cheese. That just sounds really, really interesting, and it looks like it's going to be really rich. Um, it's squishy, too. We've got butternut squash mac and cheese, mezzi rigatoni pasta with butternut squash some butternut squash ravioli, 
some goat cheese and sun-dried tomato ravioli. Nathan really loves goat cheese and sun-dried tomatoes, so I'm gonna let him try this one. I've got New Zealand sharp cheddar cheese. I like sharp cheddar cheese a lot. Um, never tried New Zealand's, but I think it's gonna be really good. And then Italian dried salami, California red wine with a hint of garlic. Oh boy, it's gonna be a party. So yeah, it should be a lot of fun. Um, if I get a chance, I will show you the little cheese board for lack of me saying the word again. Um, but yeah, that was my Trader Joe's haul. Very exciting. Now I gotta drive like 35 minutes home, so let's hope it stays nice and cold. <laughs> see you guys later. If you enjoyed this video, give it a big thumbs up. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. See you around like a donut. Bye guys.